Hello and welcome back to yet another vlog video. And this time I'm in Japan again. Like I said, there's the Pokemon Worlds happening right now, so I took an overnight flight here. I had maybe like 3 4 hours of sleep, so I'm pretty groggy right now. It's like 9:30 a.m. I touched down on 6 at 6:20 a.m. and I had to find my way here, which wasn't too hard. I took the KQ limousine bus. So it was a direct route here to Yokohama and then I just took the, the train to the current place I'm staying at. But you might ask, so is there anything going on in around Japan? Yes, there is a lot and I'll be showing you that shortly. Even my hotel has, has some decorations for that, so that's pretty cool. But the first thing I really encountered was this. Now you might ask, what's this? This is the stamp program so you know how in japan there are different stamp uh kind of like traveling things to encourage travel so you go to different places you stamp all the all the different stamps and then we collect them all i think you get a prize so this is it you can see all the trains it's the pokemon center yokohama you can see right here these are all These are all the uh, train stations that are participating in this program and because I landed at Yokohama first, I took the stamp. There's actually one where I'm staying which is uh, Sakuragi Cho station, so I'll be taking that. In fact, I think maybe that's the closest because uh, the stamp is actually a Pikachu. There's quite a few things, so you can see from here. Oh, whoops. Okay, maybe this is better. You can see. Okay, I don't know if it's kind of flipped, so uh, maybe I'll flip the video or something, but if you get three stamps, you get a postcard. You can exchange it for a postcard somewhere. If you get all ten, you get a A4 folder. And uh, if you get one of the newer lines or something, you get a tote bag with the Yokohama thing, with the Yokohama logo. So you can see it's here, somewhere around there. So yeah, for now, I just rested a little, set up, set up my things, you know, like pack my bags a little because I have to bring out some stuff. I cannot possibly carry the entire weight of going onto the plane out. And especially now that it's so hot, it actually kind of feels like home. There's no difference. The first time I came here this year, it was spring. So it was kind of cold. It's pretty nice. I didn't sweat much. But <laughs> just coming back here, I'll probably have to do a lot more laundry, but it's gonna be worth it. Alright. For now, let's just go. so far. Now wait a second. This wasn't here this morning when I walked past. Or am I blind? I think they just set this up right. And it's like this like the technically the first day. So it's like they just set it up. That's why I didn't see it in the morning. That's like oh wait what's that tent? Another Pokemon Center? It can't be right. It's like even Shake Shack is participating in this thing. It's unbelievable. This entire mall, like Queen Square, and that's what? Minato Mirai or something? It's insane. I mean, look at that. And that's just in front of Shake Shack. There are like cards from VMAX Climax. Is it? Oh no, those are old! Holy crap! That's not...
Those are GXs. Those are pretty old. Oh, the Pokemon Go series is pretty bad. Damn, it's insane. Holy crap. Ah, recently, Raikou just got a new form. Looks like a giraffe. Please use swords. Sure. The actual dinosaur is based on, but... That was pretty funny. <laughs> See, I don't know how far this stretches. Oh, hello, birdie. Uh, maybe it stops here. Let's turn around. Oh, you can see on the floor everywhere. Can you spot your favorite card? Because I can't. It's under construction. Mm, seems like there's not much here. Yeah, it's all under construction. Alright, maybe we'll just skip to the Pacifico area. Because I'm kind of lost. They have no reason being this, this size. But they still are. Oh, and they light up on the sides too. Over here. Lights up. And there uh, are two, four, six. Just, just right. It's like a full party of six Pokemon. I guess this is like the Elite Four. I don't know. But either way, damn. How much would these figures cost? <laughs> Ramen. Oh, we're going in the hot sun again. Ah, but that's Pacifico. Getting closer and closer. Oh yeah, apparently that Ferris wheel will light up at night with like Pokemon stuff. Don't know how true that is. Oh wait, this is the pop-up store? Then what was the other one? Ah yes, this is the exhibition hall. So this is the main event area. You can see. That's that banner, the welcome banner, August 11. We're two days early, but we can come back on the 11th to check. There should be more activity at the exhibition hall by then. Ah, still under construction, I see. Oh, damn, that's so cool. Hmm, you can't go in from the first floor. Seems like there's some stuff there. There should be, but we can't access that area. Oh wait, I just noticed all these tables have Pokeballs on them. Dude. <laughs> Not gonna lie, that's pretty cute. All the tables are decorated. That's some effort. Seems like there's nothing there. No entry. Well, I guess that's it. Wow, actually, there's lots of time, man. Wait. Oh no, I think that's the Pokemon Center, no? There's more things. Very highly decorated. But also, very bad news. The rain is really heavy, dude. Like crazy. I don't know how I'm gonna get back. The rain is too heavy. I might be stuck here for a bit.
Paris real life. I was talking about. I recall I saw it on Twitter, but you can finally see it. Oh my god, actually the Singapore flyer did that. There's like a lot of designs and I can see the picture walking. Pretty cool. Yeah, the drone show was so damn good. But it started to rain. It's raining right now. And there's like practically no way I can get back. Except to wait. Such is life. <laughs>